Hey guys, what's up? In the, this video, I wanted to put Messenger Insights on your radar. Um, super important tool to keep an eye on, especially when you're doing broadcast sponsored messages, um, because within the uh, Insights section of your Facebook page, you can actually find the number of the percentage of negative feedback on the messaging campaigns you're doing. When your negative feedback uh, is too high, you will get the chance uh, of getting blocked which we don't want to happen. Um, so what you need to do, you need to navigate to the page insights section of, uh, of your Facebook page. And on the left hand side, you will see messages. When you scroll to messages, you will find messenger insights and you can scroll or you can select a specific date. Now, what I want to show you here is, as you can see here, we have a block rate of 1%. Awesome. Um, my sort of benchmark is anywhere between one and 2% block rate is is normal. Everything above um, needs your attention. Um, I don't have the actual numbers on which percentage, when you hit what percentage you get blocked, but <laughs> keep it as low as possible. Now, what I wanted to show you here is that in, um, let's say the last 28 days, it was 3%. But at some point, we saw a spike here, which was on December, uh, December 31st. And I think, let me just do it like this. We have, uh, let's do it like this. In December, we spiked uh, to 3%. You see it here. So this was sort of, we, we were nice between one and 2% and at some point we hit 3%. Now this is, this is stuff you need to be aware of. This is stuff you need to, uh, you need to see when it happens. So that's why I advise you when you're doing broadcasts and sponsored messages, um, keep an eye on this before you do before you run your next broadcast. Now, what happened here? This happened. This three we shot up to three percent on December thirty first, December thirtieth to thirty first. What happened there? Now, my assumption was, and I was able to validate this, that this was due to a sponsored messaging misconfiguration. Because what a lot of people do not know is that. When you run sponsored messages, you really need to add a specific target, a specific audience, and also just to be safe, exclude audiences. Who do you want to target? You want to target your messenger subscribers. So what you need to do, and I'll show you in a little bit, what you need to do, you need to actually add the audience, the actual audience of messenger subscribers to your ad set, and you need to exclude all your unsubscribes from your ad set just to be safe so you're not reaching everybody. If you're not doing that, if you're running sponsored messaging campaigns and you leave it open, then by default, I don't know, don't believe, I don't know why this is, but by default, you will target everybody who has a conversation, who had a conversation with your page. Now, everybody that had a conversation with your page also includes your unsubscribes. This is going to get messy really quick. That is why I advise you to use those custom audiences. In previous videos, I already showed you how you can create custom audiences from your ManyChat subscribers, so I'm not gonna go in there, but I just wanna quickly walk you through. So just quick recap, insights, messaging, go to your messenger insights and just keep an eye on, uh, on your block rate. If you see any spikes, reverse engineer to see what happens. When you're doing frequent broadcasts, do make sure every time when you send a new broadcast, you go into your messenger insights first to see what your block rate is. Keep an eye on this. Keep, keep in mind, this is a 24 hour delay. So just be aware of that. Now, um, you can create website custom audiences in, you can update your website custom audiences based on your messenger subscribers in rules. In this scenario, every time a tag unsubscribed is applied, I update my custom audience uh, ManyChat unsubscribes. I use ManyChat unsubscribes as an exclusion and I have the same setup to create audiences from subscribes. Now, this is what it should look like. When you create a sponsored messaging campaign, you choose sponsored messages at the ad set level, got your daily budget there, and this is a safe setup. You choose your actual audience you wanna target, ManyChat subscribers all, and you exclude your ManyChat, ManyChat unsubscribed, and you're good to go. By default, I just leave it on the standard bid, the maximum, whatever the bid they suggest, I leave it there. Don't, uh, don't mess with that. Um, 
and then just let it run. Uh, in this scenario, you will never target people who unsubscribe. Those are the people that will give negative feedback, that will block you because, hey, they unsubscribed. Why do they get a message in their inbox from you? Hope this makes sense. Just keep an eye on your insights. Make sure you create website custom audiences from your managed subscribers and you use those in your inclusions and exclusions. Again, if you got any questions about this, do make sure you uh, drop a comment or a question below this video and we'll take it from there.